Hi, can you believe that Beverly Hills 90210 was released 33 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now, who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Brian Austin Green was born on July 15, 1973 in Van Nuys, California, USA. He played the character David Silver in the TV series when he was 17 years old in 1990. He is currently living happily at the age of 49. How? No way. Huh. Not until you apologize and admit that you're just as bad as I am. The body doesn't think I'm poisoning it with, you know. Yeah. It's, then it doesn't fight back. I would eat food and it would literally, it was like I, my body didn't process any of it. And so then... Shannon Doherty was born on April 12, 1971 in Memphis, Tennessee, USA. She played the character Brenda Walsh in the TV series when she was 19 years old in 1990. She is currently living happily at the age of 52. Everyone here has known everybody forever. All I wanted is to blend in like I used to. And not only won't you give me money, but they... The times I think about it, I take meds every single night, and that's when I, I have to think about it because I'm swallowing pills and I'm not a good pill sw swallower. I'm, like, terrible me at it. Me neither. I'm a Carol Potter was born on May 21st, 1948 in New York City, USA. She played the character Cindy Walsh in the TV series when she was 42 years old in 1990. She is currently living happily at the age of 74. Well, then you have a short memory. Think back to when you had to see Dr. Donner about that lump in your breast. Or do we have to refresh your memory about this family's medical history when it comes to cancer? I had about that because I knew that a lot of kids were looking at this show and they're looking at what moms do. And moms, I mean, in the home is the one place. Jenny Garth was born on April 3rd, 1972 in Urbana, Illinois, USA. She played the character Kelly Taylor in the TV series when she was 18 years old in 1990. She is currently living happily at the age of 51. Every vice in the world, don't take away my fam. Well, you didn't work this hard to clean up your act to see the drop dead of skin cancer. Yes, mother. <sighs> did, did it actually get physical? Yeah, I'm a Midwestern girl. Right. And uh, I spent some time in Glendale, Arizona. Okay. So uh, that makes you... Tori Spelling was born on May 16, 1973 in Los Angeles, California, USA. She played the character Donna Martin in the TV series when she was 17 years old in 1990. She is currently living happily at the age of 50. It's on my nerves. She's got no class. Steve can do better than that. So why don't you go tell him? Very funny. Gosh, who knows if we would have survived it if we'd been like acutely aware that everybody was focused on us. Mm. Mm. I well, was 16, yeah. 17, like, do you mind going? James Eckhouse was born on February 14, 1955, in Chicago, Illinois, USA. He played the character Jim Walsh in the TV series when he was 35 years old in 1990. He is now living happily at the age of 68. Pictures here, Dad. All right, Dad, what's your dream college for me? Well, there's. A lot of good colleges that are up. Jim. Kind of relieved. I, I was worried about watching it. But um, I felt like, you know, there was, there's real honest, honest chemistry. And, and Jason Priestley was born on August 28, 1969 in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. He played the character Brandon Walsh in the TV series when he was 21 years old in 1990. He is currently living happily at the age of 53. You don't have to explain. It's okay, really. Hey, babe, I know my restaurateur rights. When can you start? I'm sorry I took up your time. Didn't you hear me? On a crane, pulling away from in the rain, and, okay. you know, Luke and I were just, you know, having the best time shooting all that stuff, and, you know, I, uh, I, I think back. Gabrielle Carteris was born on January 2, 1961, in Scottsdale, Arizona, USA. She played the character Andrea Zuckerman in the TV series when she was 29 years old in 1990. She is currently living happily at the age of 62. There you are. I was about to give up on you. Sorry, Chief. I was going to call you last night, but it got a little late. Likely story. Come here. I want to show you a circle. 
it was wonderful and it was amazing. They, everybody had kids now. Like we were adults. We were raising our children. Our children were playing. Luke Perry was born on October 11, 1966 in Mansfield, Ohio, USA. He played the character Dylan McKay in a TV series when he was 24 years old in 1990. We regret to inform you that in 2019, he passed away at the age of 52, leaving us deeply saddened. I don't know, Prince Tyler Waves, hold up. Brenda's been looking for you, man. We, uh, just saw the news. Yeah, finally caught up with the old man. Is everything okay? And when they started telling me about their experience and I heard some of the math about what goes on around this disease, I, I was kind of blown away in that it is... Uh Ian Ziering was born on March 30th, 1964, in Newark, New Jersey, USA. He played the character Steve Sanders in the TV series when he was 26 years old in 1990. He is currently living happily at the age of 59. You guys make a great couple. We're not a couple. Hold on a second, handsome. You mean you passed up an opportunity with Kelly Taylor? What happened? in southern <laughs> France, but no, I'm uh, probably about five miles from where you guys are. Um, I've been living here for 28 years, believe it or not. Michael Durrell was born on October 6, 1943, in Brooklyn, New York, USA. He played the character Dr. John Martin in the TV series when he was 50 years old in 1993. He's now living happily at the age of 79. And don't tell me you're not taking it because Kelly will just write you another check. Oh no, I'm taking it. I'll take it. I may not cash it. But I'll take it. Honoring obligations, keeping business business, I'm very... Joe Itada was born on September 13, 1936, in the Bronx, New York, USA. He played the character Nat Bocicio in the TV series when he was 54 years old in 1990. We regret to inform you that in 2022, he passed away at the age of 85, leaving us deeply saddened. What the hell are you doing? Come on, Nat, the guy's a jerk. He's been on my face since the day I met him. Oh, yeah? Well, that guy's been through thick and thin with me, and he can go on that joint need any time he wants. Hey, I'll go... Mark D. Espinosa was born on June 24, 1960, in Beaumont, Texas, USA. He played the character Jesse Vasquez in the TV series when he was 33 years old in 1993. He's now living happily at the age of 62. It's politics and personality that tip the balance. You're going to need two out of three to back you in there. Meaning, we're gonna have to win a few friends, alright? Alright. Hi, Brandon. Hi. Let me know who's your favorite character from the TV series Beverly Hills 90210 and share your thoughts on the deceased actors by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.